Welcome all to Mountain Blade Warband. We are currently in a tournament now. We just started and uh, we're going to place a bet and we'll fight on the next round. Oh my. been a while since I've done a tournament. Ooh, that was actually a good shot. You don't think you are better than me. Well, with bow and arrow perhaps, but... Don't move, just get my arrows. Yay, headshot. Who's that? We're missing. Him and me. Yay. Well, we've got a zero headshot. Wow. Yay, we got big boss Fradnaka. These spiders are hard to maneuver. of the big bosses. Oh, you're a big boss as well. Ah. No, it was Drebnaz. Mm -mm. Oh my. Should have kept on running. Where is this guy that has so much archery proficiency? Scarsnick. Um, I, I do believe it would be better having a shield. Oh yes.
Let's try and get a headshot or something. Yay, we got a headshot and uh, whoa, somebody's shooting at us. That guy has a very good proficiency. Don't hit me. Green nose git. Yeah. Okay. Shield up. Yeah. Always a good choice having a shield up. Oh no. There's no way we can beat this guy now, is there? Oops, shield bash by mistake. There you go. Down. Hee. <laughs> nice. Very nice. Ooh. Whoa. 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 He actually hit me. I will tell my mummy. Who are you? To hit me like that. Come on. Who are you? Big Boss Grizz no git. Eh. Yeah well. And there we go, tournament done. So let's visit the tavern. What have we got here? Cult Master. That is Ramon. Ransom Broker. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, we're not taking blue skins, only green skins. So we're going to the castle, join the feast. Uh, hello, your sister, Big Boss Golf. Hmm. And. Uh, who we got here? Libby. Daughter to Big Boss Snarskit. Hmm. I am actually thinking... Fradnaka. Hmm. Smithat. Yeah, I'm looking for a suitable companion. I think the one that gave me a... Yeah, it was this one. Yeah. Right, Libby. You one day will be my companion, I hope. And we'll make very nice goblins. Green goblins. To let's check my village. What did I actually forgot to Yeah, I did. Never mind. Maybe they need them on scabby eye. I 
Now this is a good amount of profit. 17,000. Come on, scabby eye, please. They go s to such a roundabout way just to get there. It is highly annoying. Mm, still building schools. Mm, okay. Okay, let's teach them how to defend themselves. I was hoping to get rid of the cattle and get a better relationship with the village. Oh, I think this is going to hurt. Come on. Yep, I had them. Oh, I look so impressive. Right, some of my people just level up. And leveling up is what it's all about. Hmm, let's get four stab up. And training the peasants. It is a rather boring job, but it needs to be done. Oh, just one. Yep. Come on. Come on. That's it. You nearly got me. Not. But I do look so nice. And there we go. Everyone and their nannies. Let's charge. Usually. I like to stay put. But not today. I want to have a bit of fun. You leave my peasants alone. When you attack my village, you made it personal. Yes, yes. Come here, you must be the leader. Come here. You might, you might, you might. Yeah. He's gone. Or is this that this is this guy leader? Ah. No. There you go. Yeah. Better stay away from my village. I will refuse. Any task? How many animals? There you go. Still working on it. Oh yeah, I need to get out of the village. There we go. There we go. Anything else? Yeah, I thought you would not need anything else. So we're gonna help Stinkins. They might need cattle as well. This is more like an update episode today, because um, Due to the goblins' nature of their troops, which is rather low, grain uh, seven. No, sorry about that. Thought you want cattle. 
Uh, it is very hard for me to keep on recording because it's going to be I don't know how much time I've spent just trying to upgrade the army get into a fight and then get annihilated or we lose enough troops that I need to go back replenish them train them and go back to the fight again and what really pisses me off is that whenever I do get a thief most of the times it goes to someone else that already has quite a bit grain again no I'm not gonna give you any grain let's go over there because as you can see my troops are not that bad but when it comes to fighting it is dreadful We've got black orc bosses, we've got lots of goblins, trolls, but it's still not enough. Especially when these guys have so much Oh let's get the deserters. Let's get the deserters please. They got so much crossbows and large shields that protects them against the arrows that the goblins have yeah the only ones that are actually using firearms it's uh, me and my goblin companions And then again, our shields that our forces use are very fragile. They break very easily. So I'm mixing up the orcs just to give us a little bit of it. A bit of better chances stakes whatever because uh, let's get um yeah yeah you may try There they go. Oh, I missed. And as you can see, our archers, they're not that good either. And we're done. Yeah, this is not worth taking. But it is good for level up. Because I do need to spend a little bit more time with these guys, leveling them up, getting them higher strength, power strike, iron flesh the works 
but these ever since I bought their new gear they're actually quite good so let's go to Ayan see if they need any cattle No, it's all grain. It's all grain. And I don't know, I'm trying to get and do something, but it's been really hard now. Don't have enough troops to raid or attack a city. Yeah, it's gonna run, not run, but we're gonna get yeah. is that uh, we can't actually oh, don't think we're gonna get him yeah so back to the black tower is that uh, we just can't attack like that. I got loads of level up on to do and if I do it off screen there's plenty that you guys will miss but then again if I don't do it there's no way I can take 212. Yeah that's but this is this is the issue these guys now they're gonna attack me no they went and hide on the black tower which is now about 300 and something Oh, we did read the book. It's not too bad then. Yeah, you already died of old age. Shall I abandon the siege? No. It might be a good idea because I've got plenty of them over there. So we'll wait until tomorrow. And yeah, we will abandon the siege. It's far too many for me to actually. Oh, fight them. They they grow powerful very quickly, and we are just this. We are just in this. And to prove my point, here it is. wasn't me hitting that horse they would have been 
slaughtered. Come on, come on. Reload, reload, reload. Reload, please. Reload. There we go. See? This is what I meant. These guys have very strong shields. And Ow. Come here, come here, don't run. Oh well. We're doing okay because we're in some open field and they don't have any cavalry on them. The one they had, we actually crush them quite quickly but still got two wounded yeah not not happening but these shields they take lots of punish punishment and yeah let's take that and that and that's it I'm going to Zandri First, we will. Oh, we've got no more books to read. Okay, my bad. Tribal recruits. No, yeah, why not? We got room. At least some of our troops are rising on the ranks. Three and a half, three one. That nah, we'll never get them. You might get. Good mercenaries on Zandri. Yeah, but this episode was just a um, little bit of venting sharing my thoughts about what to do not that thrilling either so I do apologize for that oh, I should have taken those guys what 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 we do got There we go, another companion. And these guys, bone smashers now. Yep. So let's get Vuduk. Near Death Thrall. And, yep. Let's sell this and let us buy that, that, that. There we go. Right. Sorry for the boring episode. I think 
I'll end this now. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching again.